हर हर महादेव फ्रेंड्स गुड इवनिंग वी आर राइट नाव ऑन काकरमत्ता फ्लाई ओवर एंड स्लोली एंड ग्रेजुअली वी आर मूविंग टूवर्ड्स बनारस रेलवे स्टेशन फ्रॉम देयर वी विल मूव टू मडवाडू चौराहा फ्राम देयर आई विल टेक यू डाउन द फर्स्ट इनर रिंग रोड ऑफ वाराणसी विच इज़ ऑल्सो नोन एज शिवपुर लहतारा फोर लेन प्रोजेक्ट यू कैन सी द ब्यूटी ऑफ द लाइट्स on either side of the road and this kind of transformation has only taken place under the guiding leadership dynamic leadership of our honorable mp and the pm of india prime minister of india shri narendra modi ji in the last 10 years varanasi has seen lot of developmental changes infrastructural changes and this positive change of events have only contributed to the ease of life of the residents of varanasi uh we are moving towards uh, banaras railway station from here which is also known as madwadi railway station and uh, madwadi railway station is also an example of the kind of changes varanasi has seen in the last 10 years this railway station used to be almost dilapidated now it has undergone a transformational change from here we will move towards uh, madwadi choraha on the left flank of the madwadi choraha we have also another project undergoing that is phase 2 of first inner ring road of uh, second inner ring road of varanasi which will move from uh, ravinpuri to blw to vijaya belupur uh, tri junction and it will cost around uh, rupees 236.79 crores 236 crores 79 lakhs so it's going to be a huge project also it will also be a huge infrastructural boost to varanasi it will also reduce the cost of it will also reduce the uh, time taken between the places the different places of varanasi and now we are approaching madwadi choraha from here we will move towards uh, the first bridge uh, the first lahartara flyover of the inner ring road project on the left flank of the road you can see the automobile showroom of uh, fox wagon kia and other other important brands also you can see the quality of roads the kind of transformational changes that we have seen in the last 10 years people who have lived here for long enough they can only recall the days when we used to have puddles in the road in this particular area now we have seen quite a change and we enjoy it a lot the kind of roads we have now and the kind of inner ring road has been made it has considerably reduced the time taken between kakarmatta to kacheri and uh, there was a time uh, when we used to reach uh, kachari in 45 minutes moving from kakarmatta to kachari now it has reduced the time considerably now we reach there in 10 15 minutes and the kind of traffic jam we have witnessed in our childhood are the are the stuff that we still remember we st- shudder to remember now our journey of lahartara flyover starts the this flyover uh, has cost 26 crores and it was opened for public on 31st august 2023 and once we cross this flyover we will reach to the first rob uh, which is of uh, y size and uh, from there we can see on the left side you can see we are just crossing the lahartara uh train junction from where we can move towards mohan sarai or elahabad and the rob that is being made that has been made on one side we can come down to baulia on the other we can move towards lahartara and the rob starts at uh, lahartara gate number 4 the crossing gate number 4 and it has cost almost 88.46 crore that is 88 crores 46 lakh 
and length of the ROB is uh, 643.630 meters and this project has seen lot of challenges formidable challenges from public from other government agencies so now you can see the ROB starts from here and it's a Y shaped ROB uh, this is the first ROB that we are crossing there will be another ROB so as I have already discussed it has cost already 88.46 crores and it is on the Lahartara uh, gate number 4 that is and uh, as I have already discussed uh, these ROBs have seen the construction of these ROBs have seen lot of formidable challenges from local public that is Ghosia Basti where there were 58 uh, housing quarters had to be relocated under uh, Asra Yojana Asra scheme and uh, the project faced lot of litigation also as i have discussed its length is the uh, length of the rob is 643.630 meters and from there the road is almost uh, 5.3 kilometer the entire cost of the project is 400 crores almost and uh, from here you can see on the left side we have you can see the railway property is being seen and uh, the kind of smooth sleek road that we are moving on is such a beautiful sight to behold you can see the railway property on the left uh, right side and on the left side we will see i will show you how the government had to go for that extra mile to relocate 12 quarters of uh, jail uh, Varanasi jail uh, employees it was also a very difficult task because it also cost a lot to the government uh, the second ROB that is on railway crossing 5 has also cost government 62.61 uh, crores and its length is 627.280 meters so from here you will see uh, there is another bridge that starts on the left flank of the bridge there is Varuna river and this Varuna bridge has also cost uh, uh, almost uh, it is 107 meter long and it has cost 34 crore on the left side of this bridge is Varuna river which is one of the tributaries of Ganges and its inauguration took place on April 2022 almost two years back and from here we will move towards Kacheri and on the left side on the left side we will move towards Babatpur airport crossing Sant Atulanand school and uh, Shivpur Choraha and all and now we are moving towards Kacheri side so this was the the first inner ring road of Varanasi.